actually painting on a person. You you might get to a certain stage where you're thinking it's not working, it's you know, looking like shit. But you have to actually work through that until it starts looking better again and um, get to the finished product because in a canvas or when you're painting a canvas, you know, if you get to a stage where you think, oh, that's just not working for me, you can walk away and, you know, the half done canvas gets put in the back of the cupboard and forgotten about and you never go back to it. Where at least with the body painting, that actually pushes me to try and become a better artist. So it's like, I think I'm just looking to enjoy the experience really. I'm actually going to be painting a, a back piece which is pretty much a skull morphing into the body. So um, yeah, we'll see how it that. I don't think I'm nervous exactly. I'm, I'm definitely interested to see how it turns out but I think you know, this would be the wrong word. I think apprehensive might be a little closer. I think once we get going it'll all just become normal very quickly. It's kind of tickly, but it's a nice sensation, it's a different way of being touched I think what you're used to. It's, yeah, it's kind of impersonal but not. Um, and then tickly again. Mostly tickly. Okay, all I'm doing now is I'm just going around and putting a bit of shimmer powder in certain areas so that when you have the photos taken, the light will actually catch the shimmer powder and actually bring that out more in the photos. So it's just to enhance it. You don't see it much when you're actually looking at it just, you know, like this, but it will actually pop in the um, photos. I'm going to do some swirlies in the brown here. So no more up there. I think it's quite a meditative process, this, but the hardest thing is sitting still for this period of time and staying as still as you can without fidgeting. I think it would be a lot harder if I was standing, I think it would be a lot more demanding on my body to start to that without moving. You have in your mind doing it one way, it's going to work, and it doesn't. So you have to actually try and work around it and think of another way that you're going to get the effect that you actually were after in the first place. Sitting around, but um, 